Hey everybody, it's Michael again with Late Night Astronomy. Comet Shushin, Sean Atlas, is just on the verge of going from a naked eye target to being something that you're going to need binoculars or a telescope to see. With averted vision, I can maybe just make it out tonight, uh, but I think at this point it's really going to be something that you're going to want to have a pair of binoculars to go out and see. I've actually been more impressed with the binocular view of it, uh, seeing a wider area of space for the tail moving away from it, than I've actually been with the telescope views of it. This is going to continue to be an incredible object to see all throughout the month of October with binoculars and a telescope as it continues to travel through the constellation Ophiuchus. One thing that's been really interesting about this comet that I've noticed in some of the photography I've been taking is the anti-tail that's starting to come out of the front of it. This is something that I'm not seeing visually. It's not going to show up in this video, but in long exposure astrophotography, it's a pretty incredible thing to see. For me personally, I think this is the second best comet I've ever seen in my life, with the first being Hale-Bopp back in the late 1990s. If you're able to get out to see this comet, please continue to let us know how your observations are, and feel free to share any pictures or video that you're able to get of it over with me on Instagram at Late Night Astronomy. Thank you all so much for your continued support. Continue to enjoy this comet, and clear skies from Late Night Astronomy.